Here we're asked to solve and graph the solution set to this linear uh, system of linear inequality. So first we're going to do is graph these equations on the same set of axes, shade in the regions, and look for their intersection. Let me draw a Cartesian coordinate system. Okay, here's a blank rectangular coordinate system. Now, let's look at the first line. It has a y-intercept at negative 4, so let's put a, a dot there. Two points in terminal line. So here, if I mark off the slope, 2, I go up 2, rise 2, run 1. Two points in terminal line. If I rise 2 and run one more, I get that x-intercept for free. So use a straight edge and graph that line. Notice I'm doing, I'm drawing it in as a dotted line. If you look at the original system right here we had a strict inequality right there's no equals so that means the points on the line actually are not included in the solution set now we want to graph all the numbers all the ordered pairs that satisfy this first inequality so if you choose a test point say 0 0 0 is certainly greater than negative 4 so I could shade in all of the solutions for the first equation like that. Okay, now let's focus on the second inequality. Here the y-intercept is negative one and the slope is one half. So I'm gonna go I'm gonna rise one and run two. Okay, so if I draw on that line, it'll look something like this. Notice I drew that in solid here because we had uh, inclusive inequality. Now if I choose a test point on that inequality, say 0, 0, um, 0 is not less than negative 1. So 0, 0 is not in the solution. So the solutions for that one, I can shade this way. Now for a solution to the original system, we're looking for the points that satisfy both of these inequalities at the same time. In other words, we're looking for the intersection. Okay, where do these two regions intersect? I think it's fairly clear that they're going to intersect right here. So any ordered pairs, any points in this region here are going to solve the original system of linear inequalities. And you can actually test that. You could try, say, negative 3, comma, maybe negative 4, and see that it really does work.